All right. So this is the second prototype of Noodle's toe apparatus, our foot apparatus. Uh, the original one involved solenoids, which didn't work because the solenoids weren't strong enough to actually actuate anything. So in this version right here, I have a servo motor mounted at the top, which you can see, and it makes use of like rotating cams to sort of press the toes out through their appropriate channels. So I'm going to turn this and show you what it does. So Okay, so as this spins, you can see these toes kind of push out like I said they would. Uh, there's still quite a bit of play uh, in the design, so I need to go back and tighten everything up. But um, in an ideal situation, when the cam bit is rotated to this point, it's going to be pressing down on this kind of like uh, bumpy bit right here. And at that point, it will be forcing all of the toes downwards, and as it rotates back, it'll allow it to come back up. So it's basically that ram that's causing the actuation. Except it's very chafy right now because it's 3D printed and there's a ton of friction. So. Um, I don't know if this motor is going to actually be able to turn this piece, uh, even if I sand it and remove as much friction as I possibly can. But if it does, then I'm going to go ahead and add the second motor to this bracket and start working out the rest of the mechanism for his tongue, which is something I added to this version of Noodle's mechanical foot that this old one didn't actually have yet. So uh, at the bottom, you can see that there's a little pokey bit like hiding up inside of there. So his, his magical yellow silicon tongue is spring-loaded and if I press on this piece in the middle with my finger at the moment, yeah. So he... And I don't really want to have it poke out any more than that, because if he is licking the ground while he's standing on his foot, then I don't want it to accidentally kind of like poke out a whole bunch and like knock him off balance or anything. So like this, I don't know, quarter to half an inch seems like the appropriate amount of tongue darting, but yeah. In any case, uh, this is looking a lot more promising than this guy did.